John 19.27 Eta lege to mathete ide he metersu kai ap ekenes tes horas elaben ha mathetes altein esta idia Right before this, Jesus has said to his mother, Behold your son, uh, referring to his beloved disciple, John, the brother of James. And we read, Then he said, notice a narrative or historical present, he said to his disciple, again, the relationship his is implied. When relationships are implied, the article is usually present with the noun. So then he said, Jesus said to his disciple, Behold your mother. And obviously meaning here now, John is your mother. I'm asking you to take care of my mother as if she were your mother. And we read, and from that hour, that struck me that it had the word hour. It didn't say day or it's (laughs) from that moment, right? From that hour. Notice how the demonstrative pronoun here, the far demonstrative, is used attributively. When it is used attributively, it occurs in the predicate position, meaning the noun it modifies has an article. And then it does not. So from that hour, the disciple, his disciple, took her, that is, took Jesus' mother, literally, it says, into his own things. But this is an idiom here for household, into his household, into his home. The last part here, you probably know the adjective idios. Idios means one's own or peculiar, uh, one's particular thing or one's own. And here we have, you'll notice it's a neuter plural article that substantizes the adjective uh, one's own things, right? Into one's own things. But again, if you look in BDAG, there's even an entry for this because uh, the neuter plural form is used uh, not infrequently as an idiom for household. So uh, the disciple, this disciple took, notice the second heiress there of Lombano, took her into his household.